What the hell are you doing here? Ah. Sad performance. A tiny gust of wind and he would have toppled over that was anyway. Lucky. You'll be sorry for that. What the hell are you? He's had enough. I've been thinking the whole thing over. And? Have you thought of anything better? Yes. I want to be able to take on the Rice Lord and his thugs. Ah. You wouldn't be the first to try. I will defeat the Rice Lord and his thugs, if you help me. Good. I've sworn I'll never attack anyone again. But I never said I wouldn't teach anyone else to do it. I'm all ears. If you want to hit powerfully, you need to know the right tactics. That's the first thing you learn as a smith. Learn to push your whole arm through, from the shoulder down to the wrist. The better you get at that, the more powerful the blow. You'll get the hang of it pretty quick. Thanks for your help. Use your knowledge for a just cause, and for nothing else. Ah, it's you. My friend Lester from the swamp camp told me all you did there. For somebody who hasn't been here for long, you've come quite a way. I came quite close to becoming worm food a few times, too. I have an important message for the magicians of water. Then you should talk to Satyrus. He's the highest of the water mages and spends all day studying some writings or other. But no matter how important your message is, the guards of the upper level won't let you through to him. Can't you put in a good word for me? I can't, but Kronos, the Keeper of the Ore, might be able to give you permission. Where can I find this Keeper of the Ore? If you proceed from here, you'll come across the big dwelling cave behind the dam. Kronos is usually at the grid over the big ore mound, but he's a bit arrogant. You'll have to convince him that your message is important. See you later!
obvious there would be trouble ahead. I have an important message for Satyrus. What could be so important that our spiritual leader should interrupt his important studies for it? Kor Kalam has left the Brotherhood with some fanatical Templars. He wants to find the sleeper on his own and wake him up at all costs. I've never trusted him, second guru or not. He's vain, insidious, and he's capable of anything. The Brotherhood is better off without him. I'll tell Satyrus about it as soon as I get the chance. Leave now. Step aside. Iberian, the leader of the sect camp, is dead. What? How could that happen? The Brotherhood performed a ritual, invoking their god. It seems the mental strain was too much for Iberian. That's very sad. Iberian was a reliable ally, but it's no reason to justify interrupting Satyrus' studies. Step aside! The gurus have recognized that they're praying to an evil arch-demon. All of a sudden, they now think their sleeper is a demon? Sounds like another mad idea of the Brotherhood, but should they be right? All of us in the colony here might be in grave danger. You must report to Satyrus at once. He must decide what is to be done. Where can I find Satyrus? Go to the upper level. Tell the guards there that you have my permission to pass. The password is Tetriandoch. Satyrus is by the pentagram. He spends almost all day there studying how to blow up the big ore mound. Step. Aside. Stop! Nobody may pass without the password. Must be something about that story after Probably right. The password is Tetradanach. Wrong! Password is Tetriandach. That's right. You may pass. If you think, let's talk about something else instead. Hang on. I wouldn't like to be in his shoes, though, because he. Who are you? I am Nefarious, magician of the Circle of Water. Where can I find Satyrus? Go through the big round gate. You'll find him there. I'd like to become a magician of the Circle of Water. <laughs> Not so fast, my boy. Before we let a young man join us, he needs to have done something great. And he must have served us for some time. If you are really serious, you should join our mercenaries. There you can serve us. And maybe one day, you'll be granted a chance to do something great. I have important news from the Brotherhood's camp. If Kronos gave you permission to visit me, it must be important news indeed. Iberian is dead. 
He died during the ritual invocation of the sleeper. You bury on dead? That's bad news. Very bad news indeed. Who's leading the Brotherhood now? That power-hungry and deceitful core Kalam? No, Kalam has turned his back on the Brotherhood. He's taken some Templars with him. Nobody knows where they've gone. Why is that? He was in second place after Yuburion. Certain events have convinced the Gurus that their way is the wrong one. Their god seems to be an evil archdemon. One of the Gurus nearly killed me under the influence of the Sleeper, although I had saved his life just briefly beforehand. Kor Kalam was the only Guru who didn't want to admit the true nature of the hellish creature. That's why he's left the camp in the swamp. I see. Well, at least we're lucky in this regard. Korangar is a good man. He's tough, but honest. If anybody could prevent the Brotherhood from falling apart after this spiritual catastrophe, he can. I have this almanac. Iberian used it to charge the focus. Very good. We need the knowledge contained in this book to charge the five original focus stones. I'll take the almanac. I have this focus. You're holding the key that can unlock all our bonds. It's one of the five focus stones which were used to create the magic barrier. And with the help of the very same focusing power of these stones, we'll tear down the Great Wall of Energy. But won't that use up an awful lot of power? True. But in all these years, we've untiringly collected ore instead of trading it for luxuries with our jailers. As you must know, each ore nugget contains a certain amount of magic power. With the aid of the energy thus amassed in the ore mound, we'll be able to destroy the magic barrier. Sounds dangerous. The explosion will be merely of a magical nature. It will only destroy everything that's been modified by the magic inside the barrier. There is no danger to us human beings. Here, take the focus. I hope it really will be of some use to your plans with the ore mound. What are you going to do with the focus and the almanac now? Nothing. We need the four remaining focus stones first. Unfortunately, we don't have any of these four magic stones. I'm willing to find the four remaining focus stones for you. After all, I'm quite keen on getting out of here sometime myself. I must warn you, searching for them will prove as difficult as it will be dangerous. Since conflict with the old camp is getting worse every day, I cannot give you any mercenary either. You'll be totally on your own. Well, that's nothing unusual for me. I'll find a way to organize these things. Your confidence does you credit, but you'll need some items to assist you. Take this map here. It's old, but on it you'll see the original locations of the focus stones when the barrier was created. Also, this spell scroll will enable you to travel back to our camp faster. Finally, you need to speak to Riordian. He brews the potions for the camp. You'll find him in his hut, here, on the upper level. May you return in one piece?
Hey, you! Get out of here! You've been hey, lucky there. What were you doing in there? Beat it before I beat you! I'm not listening to all the blathering anymore. Satyrus sent me. Ah, uh, come here. I've already been informed. Here, take these potions. They're potions of all kinds. Now go and bring us the focus stones. These artifacts are our only hope. Greetings, magician. I am Riordian, the alchemist. I gather you want a potion? Show me your... Let's talk about something else instead.